In this question, three acrobats are standing on top of each other in a human tower. In this first part, we are interested in the forces acting on the top acrobat. There are two vertical forces acting on him. The first of these is his weight, which acts downwards and is equal to m, his mass, times by g, the acceleration due to gravity. There is also an upwards reaction force from the middle acrobat. For this acrobat to be in equilibrium, the resultant force on him needs to be equal to zero. This means that the reaction force and his weight must be equal and opposite. We can now work out the reaction force acting on the top acrobat given his mass.